Hola muchachos, este es el Flip Vocabulario Los Adjetivos Parte 1 para Español 1. Los Adjetivos Parte 1. Before we get into the vocabulario, I want to explain your diccionario because it's slightly different than what you've had previously. So if you don't notice, I already gave you the inglés and it should be in order of the videos. Okay? And you have dos columnas. You have your masculino en pronunci pronunciación aquí and femenino en pronunci pronunciación aquí. So what this is here for is I want you to really be distinguishing between the endings for our masculine or our muchachos and our feminine or muchachas. So just as a reminder, your masculino endings for the same vocab will be O, whereas femenino will be A. If it is a adjective that ends in an E, then it applies the same to both. So what I want you doing is putting in the masculino and the femenino in sus columnas diferentes, as well as the pronunciación. So, por ejemplo, let's take a look at el primero. Auto, alta. Auto, alta. Okay, so for your masculino, you'll write alto. And your femenino, you write alta with an A. Now, we do our pronunciación. So you have al, like the name al, and to, like a toe on your foot. And this one is al, like the name al, and ta, like ta-da. Okay? So that's how you'll do your diccionario. Bajo, baja. Bajo, baja. And it's ba, like ba, ho, 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 or ba, ha, ha, ha. Grande. Grande. So because it's ends in that E, it's the same for both masculino and femenino. Grande. Pequeño, pequeña. Pequeño, Pequeña. So it's pay, like I pay you. Kind of like cane, like the name cane, you know, for hockey pay. So, and then ño, like a ño sound. Or ña. Pequeño, pequeña. Gordo, gorda. <clears throat> Gordo, gorda. And it's gore, like a gory movie, gore, and dough, like a pizza dough. The dough you eat, gordo and gorda. Delgado, delgada. Delgado, delgada. So you have del, kind of like the Wisconsin dells. Del, ga, like ga, like g. Do, like the dough you eat, like pizza dough. Or delgada, like da, da. Delgada. Bonito, bonita. Bonito, bonita. So you have bow, like a bow on your hair. Knee, like the knee in your body. Toe, like a toe on your foot. Or bonita, like ta-da. Guapo, guapa. Guapo, guapa. So it's gua, like kind of like guacamole, gua, po. Or guapa. I want to point out here. You can say bonito to, like, um, especially, like, children that are boys or girls. Um, and sometimes it'll apply to places that end in an O. Um, so, like, the ocean as bonito, because el oceano. And same with guapo. So even though bonito is pretty or beautiful, and guapo is handsome or good-looking, I can say about a girl, oh, ella es muy guapa. So these do not follow the traditional English differences in Espanol. Feo, fea. Feo, fea. So it's fe, kind of like the name fe, or like, you know, like Fiona, fe, and then o or a. Joven. Joven. So it's ho, like ho, 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 and then ven. Kind of like, like Vinny, ven. And it ends in the end, so it's the same for both masculino y femenino. Viejo. Vieja. Viejo, vieja. So it's 
So it's V, like the letter V, A, like A, and then ho, 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 or ha, ha, ha. Pelo castaño. Pelo castaño. Dane Cook tiene pelo castaño. Pelo is his hair, and castaño is the color, which is brown. So it's like brown hair. And it's pay, like I pay you, low, just low, like low. And then it's castaño. Ca Stanyo. So ca, like sta, like from stan, and then yo. Castaño. Rubio, rubia. Rubio, rubia. So rubio is also referred to hair color, so it's blonde. So you have ru, like ru, like rude, ru, b, like letter b, o, or b, a. Pelirrojo, pelirroja. Pelirrojo, pelirroja. So again, referring to hair color, it's redhead. So you have pel, peli, like pelo, so same idea, but it's pel, kind of like, um, like pez, pel, and then e, like, like this e, and then rojo. So ro, ho, 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 or ro, ha, ha, ha. Moreno, morena. Moreno, morena. So we're going to talk about these differences in skin tone because they're not as definitive as they are in English. Um, the categories are broader and they're used more widely. It's just a cultural difference, so we'll talk about this in class. Um, but you have moreno and morena. So it's more, like I want more, en, like the letter N, O, or more, en, A. Blanco, blanca. Blanco, blanca. So you have blan, kind of like bland, blanco, or blanca. Pelo. Pelo. And it's pay and low. Pelo. All right. Any preguntas me dicen? Adios.